love. That is what we are doing. Papua New Guinea's Premier Rugby League competition is not giving up on their plans to have matches amid the COVID-19 pandemic, which is sweeping the globe. Stanley Hondina, manager of the Papua New Guinea National Rugby League competition, says they are faced with the COVID-19 pandemic crisis in Port Mosby, and with the recent order for a two-week lockdown, they remain optimistic. While they are waiting for approval to commence matches in Port Mosby, they also have contingencies up for discussion if there are changes to the lockdown in Port Mosby. The board is optimistic and open. Uh, they are thinking out of the box. Uh, depending on how the SOE feedback comes, depending on... There's a lot of uncertainties around there as well. Extension or uplifting of the partial lockdown or what happens. We have other alternates and plans that we've considered and we are putting before those for discussion and as and when the time comes, we'll put it through. Hondina added that the board is looking to exhaust every option to have the competition continue. We will continue to bring the game and support it. By the way of demonstration that our board took this week, instead of putting a half and a complete stop to everything, we still keep some form of game going, uh, some form of entertainment happening. So uh, that's our contribution to that. And we, we hope that uh, some normalcy will come in the weeks to come. But our board, uh, my board, is committed to standing behind this game and supporting it all the way through amidst the pandemic. Uh, to, to the last drop uh, on the decisions to make. Hondina, who has been talking to the media, showing passion towards the competition, says despite the pandemic existing in Papua New Guinea, the game had a lot of support from the public and in a way took the public pressure off the virus. The game has played uh, a vital role in the space of social and humanity. In the last four weeks, we've had people coming to the game. Uh, the talks about fear and stress and uh, worry was sometimes uh, absorbed by the atmosphere that it created at the game. With the Port Mosby matches on by this weekend, the competition now has moved the finals forward. Uh, if the approval is granted, then we will continue with the Mosby games when the teams in late take the break. So that means we're splitting the bye weekend over two weeks uh, on our schedule. So that's just like one week off. In fact, we split over two weeks, but it's one week off on by with our grand final push by a week from the 11th to the 18th of October 2020.